Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. I'm Office Bloke Daz. I'm Office Bloke Mike. I'm Office Bloke Max. Here we are, two of us and a twitcher. <laughs> <laughs> Mike the Birdman. Yeah, just looking at what Kiwis look like. Birdman Timperley. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Name's stick, mate. Uh, yeah, I know, yeah, yeah. <laughs> did you I've have been, a I've been you have called a worse. Did you have a nickname growing up? Henry. Henry? Yeah. Was you like a... After the vacuum guy, the Uber? No, it's after Henry Cooper, the boxer, funnily enough. Oh, you, well, yeah. you look like him, or? No, not at all, no. It's a long story. I mean, you Is it to do with fruit? No. Splash it all over? Not really, no, but nope. he was prevalent at the time when I yep. got the thing. It's, it's my brother. We used to play football around the corner, and over and outside Sky's house, he used to be called Mr. Cooper. And he called, started calling him Henry Cooper, after Henry Cooper, the boxer. But for some reason, he started calling me Henry. I said, well, I've called you Henry. <laughs> Why? <laughs> you have a nickname, Max? Uh, wedge. I get called Wedge. Ah, Wedge, yeah. 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 yeah and yeah, Bomber yeah. as well. Yeah. But go, go on. No, that's because me older brothers called Bomber sometimes, and some of other people called me Bomber. Little Bomber. Well. So do you, yeah. do you used to show his like... Bomber? Bomber. B O M. Let me just, I'm just stress that. All right, B O M. <laughs> you could get attached to nicknames of other people. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Like... yeah, yeah. He needs right. need yeah. one of his own, doesn't he? The Birdman of Tim Play. <laughs> needs one of his own. Twitcher, yeah. <laughs> the Birdman. <laughs> I'll have to think of one. Uh, we've not done a racco for a long time, have we? We've not actually. No, no, yeah. it's been a not while. Since, not since the last uh, place. Yeah. Fake yeah. alpha male tries and fails to intimidate man. Ooh. Fake alpha mm. male. I think you can tell who it is Some, yeah, straight think, away. Yeah, I think it's the guy on the in the white t-shirt with the uh, the baldy head. <laughs> You'd guess yeah. so, wouldn't you? It's always yeah. a baldy. That's what I'm thinking of. Yeah, he looks like it looks like he's just come straight from the gym. Otherwise, <laughs> yeah. Otherwise, yeah. fake alpha male. But anyway, mm. let's get into it. Yeah. How do you define do success? It. My definition of success is across the board. <laughs> if you're not ripped, if you're not rich, if you ain't rare, if you don't stand out, if you ain't across the board successful, it doesn't mean sh to me. If you got straight tits and you're in your Rolls Royce, you look like a fucking clown to me. I'm just laughing at your dumb fucking ass. Okay. But this is the whole fucking point. <laughs> you have a weakness. Change it, motherfucker. How the fuck are you going to lead people? It's when you wow. go out pound shopping it and you buy, uh, have you got any Andrew Tates? <laughs> I'm the pound yeah, shop. Yeah, literally. <laughs> yeah. That is GCSE Andrew Tate. Yeah, yeah. isn't it? <laughs> people, if you don't realize your weakness is their way out. They're not going to listen to you. You're sitting there possessing shit that they don't want to have. So, I mean, this is what people say. Oh, it's not about the money. It's about family, Wes. It's about this, about that. Motherfucker. When you're making money, it's about the money. When it's family, it's about family. When you're at the gym, it's about muscle. Whatever you're doing, it's about that. There's no black and white life. It's the gray Talking area. Shy. He's good you at have it. to be Talk. good at everything. That's the goal, to really excel in every area. And that's the worst thing about these motherfuckers. They try to give you relationship advice. You got a borderline Miami 2. That's like a fucking Mississippi 6. Don't give me relationship advice to my 10 when you got a 2, motherfucker. Shut up. But this is this whole thing. People don't think I'm going to put the measuring stick to their motherfucking face. They better just watch what they say around a motherfucker who's beating them in every area. They better have a bad bitch. This guy comes across wow. to me like somebody who's like, and he's like, how old do you think he is? Early 40s? Yeah, probably mm -hmm. something like that. What an absolute charm. Who thinks he's fucking 28? Yeah. Yeah, funny. Thinks he's yeah. it basically thinks yeah. he's it, yeah. Which yeah, is why yeah, we used to call say, people yeah. in it. Thinks he's it. Think you're it. Mm, more like I'd say, isn't he? Yeah, yeah. yeah. You better be oh, rich. You better can be rolling <laughs> some sick shit. That's what I like. I I grew up hustling. That's me rims on my goddamn phantom. Go out front. That ain't no. That ain't normal phantom. That's a mansory phantom. I don't have the normal shit. F that chicks got upgrades done. Well said, Wes. God damn with the fire. God damn with the bullshit. This guy sounds like an absolute donor. He's saying that if you don't have a six pack and a fast car, then you're a loser and less successful than him. That just makes no fucking sense. I mean, it's just bullshit. There's plenty of men out there that don't have those things and are more high value and successful than this muppet. And I will say to some extent, there's some things I agree with. I've said before that I think men should try and be physically and mentally strong and to also have enough money to be financially stable. But I don't think success is all about money and materialism because without a family and real people around you, what's the point? My definition of success is having Having a family, having children, and being part of the apparatus of the world. And true wealth is a rejection of materialism. As Christ said himself, what good does it benefit a man to gain the entire world at the cost of his soul? It's okay to have materialism. It's not against Christian ethics to become rich, become wealthy. But I just think it's all beside the point, ultimately. You're trying to go for a single thing, and it's to achieve something greater you have than money. the person. Does, does he have money? No. Does, do you have money? No. No, I don't have. I don't have. I don't have money. But but here's the thing. Why is why is money <laughs> valuable? I'm a, just, do you why, have money? What is money valuable for? 
I'm just asking, do you have money? I just thought, no, I'm broke. I'm a nobody. No, but really you are? Yeah. Is he really broke? Yeah. I'm just saying. <laughs> <laughs> I just want to know. I have to know. No, I'm not, I'm not one of these rich guys. I don't have a Bugatti. I don't have a Lambo. I, don't I, have I a just Ferrari. really have to know. Like, how much money you got? Probably five, the five bucks in my pocket, not much uh, more. See, does anyone, can anyone answer for the guy? <laughs> Why do they think I'm kidding? I have a family. I take care of an entire family. That's yeah. That takes a lot He's of money. Right. He's doing all right. Okay. Now, me personally, I do think money's valuable because I didn't grow up with a lot of it, and I've understood that it gives you freedom and it allows you to take care of people that you love which is a great thing. However, I don't think money makes the man, and I think if you think you're better than another man because you've got more money than him, you'll prove that money doesn't make you high value or smart. Also, I classify having money as an accessory. Yeah. It's like a, it's like a benefit of like a bit of, of an accessory towards your life. So if you've got money, you can yeah. do things that's like that, that other people may, may not be able to do, or you can yeah. do things that's, that you might want to do. So yeah, it's an accessory. Mm. I don't go around saying, I've got money, I haven't got money, I've got money. If someone says to me, how much money have you got? I'll be like, it's fucking, number one, it's none of your business. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. Yeah. Why, do, why do you need to know? Yeah. What, does, what, is it going to change your opinion of me if you think it? I've got none or if I've got a load? I've, mm. Exactly, yeah. yeah. What does it matter? Yeah. Yeah. If you talk to someone, you're getting on with them, your friends with them, I mean, don't matter. <laughs> don't yeah. matter. Money, yeah. I've, I've, I've got all sorts of don't friends. Man. Some people have got, haven't yeah. got any money, some people yeah. have got a lot of money. It makes absolutely zero Yeah. Difference to me. I know, I know but, people who said to me sometimes, like, "Oh, I've got no money, and I need it." Like, what's and then I look at them, and they've got like a fucking watch on that's like worth about ten grand, mm. and I'm like, "Don't preach to me. You've got no money. You just sell that watch, mate, and you've got yeah. money." Mm. You know, it's, uh, yeah. it's, it's it's one of them sort of things. But it's I don't I don't look at people in a way of like saying like, don't, 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 for me, I don't give a shit what you do as long as you're not a knobhead. Yeah, we'll get on just fine. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah, I mean, if you've got a bit of money, like I say, it does help you do things that you want to do. It's an accessory. Like going on yeah. holidays mm -hmm. and doing yeah. whatever you know yeah. that is great yeah. for that. Yeah. But it's not a necessity to no, impress necessity. people or no. to get yeah. on with people or 100%. to be successful. Yeah. You know, but this guy's all about money, and he's like, I say, he's a pound shop Andrew Tate for me. Yeah, isn't he? yeah. I, don't, I don't think he yeah. believes what he says. I no. think it's the thing is, I don't, what I don't like show. is he's basically saying, if you haven't got money, I don't want to know you. Do you know you don't have? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> That's true. I don't yeah. think you're probably going to be a lonely old man one day if you put materialistic shit and money before your family. Mm. I'd rather be surrounded by my family than expensive objects. This is the thing, you guys. If you ain't fit, you can't say it's not all about being have being in good why, shape. Why not? If you don't have money, you can't say it's not all about money. Yeah, why not? But if he does have money, he can say that. Why not? He why can't. can't you say it? Why must you have the thing because you, because before I, you hang on, hang on. Because this is his opinion. Because hypothetical, hypothetical is hypocritical. Let me ask Hypothetical is hypocritical. How do you even know what I was going to say before I've even been allowed to ask the question? I know what you're going to say. Then what was I going to say? You're going to say, how? why can't you ask the question? Okay, so... That's not what I was going to say. What I was going to say is how in the world can you create a standard that it's inappropriate to ask somebody, how come if I don't have X thing because I don't value X thing, does that mean X thing is actually valuable? You've never experienced it, so you can't speak about <laughs> you it. You think that I haven't experienced wealth? Even I, poor I people, was asking if you did. Even poor people experience days of wealth. I was they asking can, if you did. I, I don't people, know who you are. Even yeah, but even poor people experience days of wealth. Not. And so the thing is, is no, it's no, not, definitely not. Definitely yeah, not. Def definitely, no, definitely so. Not. Definitely so. I've lived the lowest lows and the highest highs. Well, what's the, so? What's the distinction after you make X amount, hundreds of thousands of dollars? If you look at these studies done on this, it does not. I don't hugely, fit no study. It does not bro. hugely improve a person's are life. Are you proud of who the f bro, you are? Why, why, why well, look you at, are you proud? If you look in the mirror, would you guys <laughs> say this motherfucker's proud of who the f he is? That's a bag of trash, dude. Pull your fucking shirt off. Because I've been. Tell me your. I'd rather be mates with the guy in the grey shirt and this bald headed fucking Oh, loser. all day long. He's doing my nothing. Jeez, right? who does he think he is? I know, right? Jeez. He's knob. just a big bully, isn't he? Knobhead. Yeah. I've not seen anything like all that yet. No, me neither. Firstly, who's paid to see this? Uh, no, well, yeah. That's yeah. ridiculous. Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. He's, what, what a knob, though. I don't know. He's an absolute God. tool. Proud because yourself. I've been to fucking prison? Jesus Christ, because look I've been at to you, prison? bro. You got tenant charms in tits. Men don't have tits. No, guys. they go to prison. Well, you're a massive tit. Yeah. You think that that's guys, guys, better? Guys. You think that that's better? Okay. Let's let him give his his definition of success. And then... having tits and ten inch arms let's, is what a man is. Let's, you let, guys. Him, let's let him. Please get don't his... listen to that. See, look, when you meet someone that challenges his points and doesn't back down to him, he starts getting angry and throwing insults. And that's a sign of a weak man with no emotional control. And you've automatically lost a debate when you start to do this and make it personal. Tits. Anyway, back to where I was at. Boobs. Yeah, okay, prison. But anyway, if you want, <laughs> fuck yeah, if you want to follow <laughs> the successful mantra of a man who tells you he was reformed from prison, understand why they might have gone there to begin with. 
And to take yes, care of I do think. So apparently, I hope, it, I hope it was murder. Yeah, you know, <laughs> his whole personality. And I don't know about this guy, but I know other guys that have made mistakes when they're young and they've come out and they've done really well. Not all criminals are bad people, and not all bad people are criminals. So I will back the donut up on that one. However, I will say the delivery by Andrew Wilson was still funny and the bull guy's response was still dumb. You can't properly take care of your family when you're in a jail cell. I do think that a rejection of materialism is something missing in society and I do think that true wealth is the family. Being able to go home and look your family in the face and know that you're doing everything you can to support them. That's and then when I you go to the beach is. with your family, they're like, there's my stud dad right there standing there. My dad's a superhero. Look what he brought to the table. Look how hard this guy works. He came from sure. nothing to this. Yeah. He works very, he works, he's, God damn it. You're still whining. Stop whining that, that and just make an product. argument. That is a product. Dude, I'll smack your fat yeah, ass. So you're going to attack okay. You're going to attack All right, all right, all right, all right. No, all right. Look, we've all to the Yeah. Florida? You do it. All right. He called. Look let's at just... your goddamn self. Okay, guys, well, guys, I've guys, never guys, seen such guys, a pathetic mother. Okay, okay. well, let's chill out. look in the mirror, mate. This is not what men let look them, like. Let's let what do they look like? Point. Fucking shit. What do they look like? Bald prisoners? Yeah, is that what they look like? <laughs> the, the, right, this is the problem them, in let's... society. Is people like this think they can talk to someone like me like that. They really think they wow. can. He, he knows he wouldn't do shit about it, and that's the problem. I mean, you're the one who got hostile for having a difference of opinion. Dude. Check it out. You started coming at me about some other shit. Jesus yeah. Christ, men don't have this. We can agree on that. Physically. Men he, usually have he hair. Has, we can agree on that, too. He has crossed <laughs> <laughs> gender barriers. He's just way too quick and smart for him, which is now making yeah, the is. audience yeah. laugh at the Muppet. So he's only going to get angrier. He said before something like people need to understand who they're speaking to. He needs to understand which state he's in and understand that people are strapped up and his muscles will not protect him from a bullet. If you're not contributing to a moral society and you're only contributing to a consumerist society, a materialistic society, that's the only thing you're going to worship. And tons of people worship material things and flash it around, but it's vacant. It's spiritually vacant. The craziest thing is, if you looked at the people who are supposedly materialistic, we've helped more people than these guys who claim Why is helping, them. what is, why we've is helping, wait, 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 why lives. is helping important to you? I mean, because I know what it's like to be at the bottom. So, okay, so we, are you helping someone if you give them an expensive watch? Why do you think we just do that? You must not know who you're talking to. I asked you to. a question, you didn't answer it. I give them the habits to build themselves. What did I something. ask you, though? Said, am I helping them if I give them an expensive watch? I give them habits, a mindset. So the I answer teach is no. Operate. So if you give no. them. But you guys are assuming we're only answer, doing no, stuff no. about materialism. Can a man answer a direct question? <laughs> Jesus Christ. <laughs> these fing, these characters. The answer are tough is as no. Fuck. See, look, once again, he's put on the spot. He can't answer a question, so he starts to insult He's fucking thick as shit. Yeah, that's yeah, yeah. Go ahead, buddy. How the f did these guys even get up here? Why would you bring me here with people like you this? You didn't answer the question. Dude, did. <laughs> Shit, We've got different of, of opinion here. Right. Okay, go ahead, Miguel. I'm, this is why they split it like this. <laughs> this, this. I'm sorry you got. I'm sorry you got put over there. No, I know, I you know. don't really fit over there. We need some other little fucking lame douche over there. Oh man, man. Yeah, I Come still on, answer man. the question. Is giving what, someone what, an expensive you, watch? Would any of you guys really hang out with these guys? This is not an argument. Like Jesus Christ. They're skilled. They're skilled to some things. Oh, hey, hey, said hey that. on that bass guy you, right there just said, "Hell yes, little, shut up." That's fucking hilarious. You're awesome. <laughs> <laughs> ahead, man. The whole crowd says, yeah, we'd hang out with them. Different yeah, guys this, on the this panel. is why most people don't invite me, guys, please. Guys. Different guys. Yeah, we, can tell. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> we can tell his tits are all jiggling. He's got like a half a fucking jelly donut. Hey, bro, your toupee, it's still back there in the back. Go get it. I, I shaved my head. You, you sure? They, are you sure you, you okay, shaved okay, your head? Okay, or? okay, okay. We got all right. Chill. Go ahead, Miguel. <laughs> bro, George Michael wants his pants back. Dude, God damn! Look at who said that. Dude, your mom bought you that. Your aunt bought you that for fucking Thanksgiving dinner. That's Great like comeback, mate. Great comeback. Or some Ooh. shit, bro. Welcome Jesus to the, welcome to the roast, roast session today. Dude, any of you guys oh, who yeah. fucking like holy shit. Room. If those are men to you guys, I mean, who's going to invite him anywhere? Who wants to be around a raging, insecure little donor? And I think he thought the crowd were laughing with him, but they're laughing at him. He also thought he was going to bully these guys and make them look like idiots in front of everyone, but it's been the other way around. You can just tell this other guy, Andrew Wilson, is not scared of him at all. He just thinks he's a fool and he's mocking him. It's the thing about materialism. You're, you, yeah, you he, worship it, guys, dude. You these worship guys it. must have grown up with money. Bro, the people you worship who didn't grow material. Up with money chase money. The worship materialism. Grow, shut the f 
fuck up. You, you don't worship know me, you fucking I can lame. tell. I can tell by your speaking. How the fuck do you think you Listen know Listen how reactive you are if someone shave says. Shave your goddamn arms, See, you can't bro. deal with it. You can't deal with it. Why would I shave my arms on the man? Look at these pale fuck. What the fuck is wrong with you? Okay. Shave your body. Aren't you a man? Look at this guy, dude. dude okay, let's let Miguel finish this real dude, quick. Let's post these guys. Shave chicks. your pubes. Hey, post these guys' right, guys, women guys, back guys, here. Guys, 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 guys. I want to see these guys, guys women. Let's guys, put these guys, trolls guys, back guys, here. Guys, guys, women guys, are not guys. objects hey, in our hey, world. Guys, we're not hey, guys, 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 relax. I've never heard more relax. lies in my life. Relax. This is one thing I don't like. Wes, 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 come on, man. Okay, take his batteries out. No, no, no. We're gonna, We're gonna move on. I We're gonna make move you on. Cry if you want. We're gonna got. move on. We're gonna move on. We're gonna move on. I could if you want. We're gonna no, move on. That's all you got is threats. And We're gonna move strength. on, guys. We're gonna I'm move a on. Great speaker. Look, We're gonna move on, it. guys. We're gonna move on. At least, okay, I, can Miguel, answer, go ahead, at least I can answer a direct question. Guys, Miguel. guys, guys. Oh my God! We're gonna move God, on. How did go you Miguel. bring me here? I thought this was like some real shit. West, West, We gotta chill, man. We gotta chill. I'll dip. West, go ahead. All right, what's success, right? Freeing the slaves, that's what it is. He tried to make a fool out of them the whole time and ended up looking like a fool himself. It's like he's trying to give this impression that he's a strong, high-value, successful man, but no high-value man acts like that or has that little emotional control. Whenever his points were challenged, he crumbled and insulted him, which makes you look like more of a donor. It's like this Socrates quote, when debate is lost, slander becomes a tool of the loser. Guy yeah. was so annoying. Yeah, no, like, like I said before, he's just a bully. Isn't he? Yeah. he just thinks he can shout at people mm. and swear at them, yeah. and then they'll be scared to say anything because yeah. he's like yeah. a big guy. Yeah. And like, so he goes threatening them, mm. and he just wants to try and shut them down because he knows he hasn't got the tools to come back at him. Yeah. He just hasn't got the intelligence for it, has he? I think it's the roids so. taking over his emotions, to yeah. be fair. Yeah, yeah. yeah. big time, isn't he? I mean, annoying. Well pumped up. Right. But even but, like he was saying, just when, when the guys come back, he had no comeback to him. No. He was like, you know, the guys give a decent comment there, and then he was just like trying to come back with threats and, and all that. And I'm like, yeah. In everyday life, yeah. you see, people won't come back at him like that. In everyday life, yeah. most people yeah. will probably stay clear of him because Walk he's a big away. guy yeah. and he'll mm. start swearing and throw yeah. threats about and stuff like that. Mm. So people, most people yeah. will think that it's just not worth it. Which is probably but why he was in prison. Yeah, but because it's yeah, on a show exactly. like this, then mm. obviously he's, he's not been able to do that. These mm. guys come on, they're intelligent, yeah. and they're just backing up the argument, aren't they? Yeah, yeah. giving people but, like this a platform uh, is never going to end well. No. Like it, mm. And I get why they're doing it, to be like reactionary and like get, go viral and get views mm. and things like that. We're in the yeah. same industry, but it's like... It's a proper tit, though, isn't it? Yeah. Oh, man, he's just... Oh, it's not even a likeable It's terrible. Dish. Like, you can get people that are dickheads that you like. You just wonder what's on. Yeah. Right. I don't know, he was talking about girls there and saying, like, what well, girl, I'd love to know what kind of girls go with people like that. Yeah. Girl. You know yeah. what I mean? Yeah. Mm. I mean, I guess he's, he's talking about having his phantom outside and all that, so I yeah. guess he's... Uh, you know, he's tooled up with his uh, with his cars and he, you know his money or whatever. But yeah, but I guess girls chase that sometimes. Oh, definitely. You know? Yeah, yeah. It's a certain type. Isn't it? There's a yeah. certain type for everyone, I suppose. So uh, it just doesn't be certain anything. types that like that type of guy. But yeah, I don't know. What mm. some tool? Yeah, exactly. Basically, exactly. But there you go. Good Ar Ar Araco as always. Yeah, so we like yeah, Araco. Baby, yeah. Good yeah. bit of a commentary from being an Arsenal yeah. fan. <laughs> there you are. Well, you know, can't have everything, I suppose. Can <laughs> yeah, you? Yeah, exactly. Never mind. Yeah. Anyway, hope you guys enjoyed that. Don't forget like and subscribe. See you on the next one. Cheers. Cheers.